There's no doubting what you've achieved on a technical level. These are clearly state-of-the-art. There are just certain design choices that were made for these robots that we don't fully understand. We were hoping that you could shed some light on those. She can dance. She can sing. She's equipped with a built-in helium tank for inflating balloons right at her fingertips. She can take song requests. She can even dispense ice cream. With all due respect, those aren't the design choices we were curious about, Mr. Afton. Hey everyone, it's Oscar. Welcome to the newly released Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. Now, I've been pretty eager to try this game, so let's not waste any time and let's see what it has in store for us. Not sure what that was referring to. Welcome to the first day of your exciting new career. Whether you were approached at a job fair, read our ad in screws, bolts, and hairpins, or if this is the result of a dare, we will. This is totally you. a dare. I will be your personal guide well, to I'd help like you to get started. Leave. I'm a Model 5 of the Handyman's Robotics and Unit Repair System, but you can call me Hand Unit. Your new career promises challenge, intrigue, and endless janitorial opportunities. Oh, good. Please enter your name and stream of the keypad. This toilets. cannot be changed later, so please be careful. Okay, let's see if I can actually do this. Uh, uh, let's... It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. Yeah, kind of. I see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. One moment. Welcome, Eggs Benedict. I'll take it. I like Eggs Benedict, I'll take it. It's a fine name for me. I gotta feel like that my head's gonna get cracked open like an egg at some point in this game, right? So we're no longer a security guard. It sounds like we're a maintenance or janitor guy. Okay. What a hell of an elevator with a big giant weird fan in the center there. You can now open the elevator using that bright red and obvious button. Okay. Let's get to work. There we go. Oh, nothing looks bad about big yellow tape across that door. Allow this isn't a crime scene or anything, is it? Silence with some light-hearted banter. Due to the massive success and even more so the unfortunate closing of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, it was clear that the stage was set, no pun intended, for another contender in children's entertainment. Okay. Unlike most entertainment venues, our robotic entertainers are rented out for private parties during the day. And it's your job to get the robots back in proper working order before the following morning. You are now in the primary control module. It's actually oh, a this looks space creepy. between the two front showrooms. Now, What's let's going get here? started with your daily tasks. View the window to your left. This is the Ballora Gallery party room and dance studio, okay. encouraging kids to get fit and enjoy pizza. Let's sure. turn on the light and see if Bellora is on stage. Uh, Press the blue button on the elevated keypad to your left. From the looks of this room, I don't really want to push anything or see outside. Can I, can I mess with that clock there? No. What is going on with these severed heads that are blinking at me? Okay. That's not weird. We're creepy. Alright. That's enough screwing around. Uh, uh oh. It looks like Ballora doesn't feel like dancing. Okay. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button now to administer a controlled shock. Maybe oh. that will put the spring back in her step. Uh. Let's check the light again. Oh, I don't know. Pissing off the animatronics Excellent. with an electrical choke. Probably not the best like her idea. Again, and we'll be ready to perform again tomorrow. Now view the window to your right. This is the Funtime Auditorium, where Funtime Foxy encourages kids to oh, play good. and share. <laughs> Try the light. Let's see what Funtime Foxy is up to. Yeah, Foxy's not there. Looks like Funtime Foxy is taking the day off. Let's motivate Funtime Foxy with a controlled shock. Huh. Let's piss off Foxy with a shock. How about that, right? Foxy's never been a pain in the ass before. 
Nothing. Let's try another controlled shock. Okay. Yeah, let's really piss Foxy off. Ooh. Looks like Funtime Foxy is in perfect working order. Great job. In front of you is another vent shaft. Crawl through it to reach the circus gallery control module. Click these. Okay, there feels like there's kind of a lot of stuff you can do, like... I don't know why you'd ever want to do that. That is creepy, but you can totally click on that. Okay, so I can crawl or go faster with the shift button. I'm definitely going to go faster because well, I don't like the idea of... Trigger. Circus gallery vent. What does that mean? Hmm. On the other side of the glass is Circus Baby's auditorium. Let's check the light and see what Baby is up to. Oh, I'm assuming that's Circus Baby in the poster there. What is going on with these little dudes hanging out here? Looks like a few of the lights are out, but we can fix that later. Okay. Let's encourage Baby to cheer up with a control shock. <laughs> Let's piss this one off too, huh? Alright. Let's try another controlled shock. Okay. Uh, it's not working. Let's try another controlled shock. Uh, are you sure about this, Mr. Handy? Oh, man. Great job, Circus Baby. We knew we could count on you. Uh, that concludes your duties for your first night on the job. We don't want you to leave overwhelmed. Otherwise, she's you not might on the not stage. Please leave using the vent behind you, and we'll see you again tomorrow. How do I do that? Because I really would like to get out of here. Oh, S to go back. Okay. What was that? Um, I'm going. Circus Gallery. S says. All right, shift completed. Day one, right? Oh, I love how this game is just lulling you into a sense of self-confidence, false self-confidence. Another dramatic entry in the lives of Vlad and his distressed mistress. Where will they go? What will they do? Oh, I can eat popcorn. All of that and more happening now. Okay. Clara, I tell you, the baby isn't mine. Count, I tell you that it is. You're the only vampire I've ever loved. And the baby turns his bottles into powdered milk. I'm um, way into that popcorn. That doesn't mean anything. He sleeps on the ceiling fan. What? Everyone does that. Or upside down. What does it matter? You need to be part of your son's life. I'm an old man, Clara. I can't be a father. Well, then at least pay your child support, you <laughs> deadbeat. <laughs> Will Vlad and his distress... Oh, I totally watch a vampire soap wrong. opera. Tune in next time. There we go. Did I eat myself sick on popcorn? Am I passing out now? Because that was my intention. <laughs> Daddy, you let the other children go see her. Why won't you let me go? Daddy doesn't like the other children? Welcome back for another night of intellectual stimulation, pivotal career choices, and self-reflection on past mistakes. Uh, I think that We're last one's probably to correct. a unique and fulfilling work experience. One part of that commitment is ensuring that you don't get tired of the voice that you're hearing right now. Using the keypad below, oh, man. please select a new companion voice. For male, press 1. For female, press 2. For text only, press 3. For other options, press 4. Uh, what's other options? Oh, alright, my keys don't actually work, so I'm gonna have to use this horrifying mess. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will okay. auto-correct it for you. Oh, Thank you for choosing, Angsty Teen. Oh, good. Oh, good. This is going to be fantastic. Let's get the hell out of here. It sounds like crawling noises through an air duct. That's what that sounds like to me. Alright, angsty teen voice. Lead me on to... 
man. It's still got the police tape on there, doesn't it? That's not. The elevator stopped. You know the routine. You can get out now or whatever. Whatever. Stay here if you want. <laughs> All right, maybe I do like angsty teen voice. So, funny story. A dead body was found in this vent once. Oh, thank God. Okay, so not that funny, but it's a story. That's true. Okay, so I make extra noise going fast. And that's probably going to allow the animatronics to find me. Okay, I'm let's start with your nightly chores. Trying to read into this you stuff. You should check on Ballora and make sure she's on her stage, but whatever. What about these little guys? Can I check on them? <laughs> Alright, they're all working just fine. Huh. I guess Ballora has better things to do. Let's zap her. That should be fun. Yeah, let's piss her off. Mm, this is gonna go sideways for me at some point, right? What is... Let's check on Funtime Foxy. Make sure he's ready for showtime tomorrow. Uh, I, I kind of want to check on Ballora, see if she's not super pissed. There's Foxy, kinda. Great. 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 There but seems to have been a problem with the voice synthesizer. Okay. Default settings have been restored. Please proceed through the vent ahead of you to Circus Baby's auditorium. Uh, all right. Night two already has a very, very distinctly motion trigger Circus Gallery vent. More creepy feel to it. I guess it's not going to be too long before I get hit. With Circus jump Baby had a busy day today. Let's check the light and make sure she's in proper working order. All right, how many people did she kill today? Oh, Circus Baby, we aren't here to play hide and seek. Let's encourage Baby to come out of hiding with a controlled shock. Damn it. All right, here we go. I didn't. Let's try another controlled shock. Uh, that's not doing anything. There seems to be a power malfunction that is affecting our ability to properly motivate Baby. Please stand by while I reboot the system. Is this the part? I will be offline momentarily during oh, this shit. process. Various other systems may be offline as well, such as security doors, vent locks, and oxygen. Oh good, I like Commencing the oxygen system part. restart. So is this the part where I say, or I hear somebody say, nobody puts a baby in a corner, huh? Motion trigger, entryway vent. Funtime auditorium maintenance vent opened. Oh good. Ballora Gallery maintenance vent opened. And I hear movement. This sucks. I don't recognize you. You are new. I remember this scenario, however. Uh, it's a strange thing to want to do to come here. My name is Eggs Benedict. Curious what events would lead a person to want to spend their nights. In a place like this, willingly. Uh, me Maybe and you, curiosity? sister. I'm with you. Maybe ignorance. There is a space under the desk. Someone before you crafted it into a hiding place, and it worked for him. I recommend that you hurry, though. You will be safe there. Just try not to make eye contact. It will be over soon. Okay. They will lose interest. Okay, can I just get under the damn desk? Okay, shit. I turn turn that flashlight off. 
I hear something awful in front of me. What was that voice? Was that a ghost? Or was that Ballora? I, mm. Man, I really hope they're not smart enough to grab whatever the hell this is that I... Okay. I don't know if I was supposed to do that all the way like that, but okay. Uh, nope. Just a breakfast sandwich in here. Eggs Benedict, that's it. Mm-hmm. Turn my I turn my flashlight off, please. You guys have like an animatronic jazz or no? animatronic funk band or not funk band jam band jesus christ can't even think oh shit no 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 oh god oh stupid baby wait how was i how was i supposed to do that Okay, so that was, was that Circus Baby? Nope. Not to make eye contact, huh? How do you know somebody's inside? What do you know? You're a baby. All you do is eat, cry, and poop. Come on, I'm holding it. I'm keeping it. Nope, you're not opening this, you little turd. Nope. God, I didn't know they could open that. Okay. I wonder if everybody falls for that for the, the first time. Nope. Nope. No. No, no. Crap, it's going to get me, isn't it? Oh, I'm gripping my mouse so tight, it feels like I'm going to snap it. You are not a friendly baby. When your guide comes back online, he is going to tell you that he was unsuccessful. That you must restart the system manually. Oh good. He will then tell you to crawl through Ballora Gallery as fast as you can to reach the breaker room. If you follow his instructions, you will die. Ballora will not return to her stage anymore. She will catch you. The power will be restored shortly. When you crawl through Ballora Gallery, go slowly. She cannot see you, and can only listen for your movement. When you hear her music become louder, she is growing near. 
Okay. Listening for you. Wait and be still. Thank you for your patience. It seems that the power system cannot be restarted automatically. You will need to restart the power system manually. Please return to the primary control module. Okay, I was going to say, if I can get out of this little space. So, through Ballora Gallery. Um, Motion trigger, Circus Gallery vent. Okay. Well, we're in the Circus Gallery vent. We're not going through the Ballora Gallery vent yet. Is that you will now be required to crawl through the Ballora Gallery using the vent to your left to reach the breaker room. My left. Okay. It is recommended that you stay low to the ground and reach the other side as fast as possible as to not disturb Ballora. I will deactivate myself momentarily as to not create an auditory disturbance. Oh man. Deactivating. Okay, this seems way harder than the other. Maintenance vent open. Five Nights at Freddy's. When I hear the noise getting, or music getting closer, don't move. Is it the singing or is it like the music box that I need to worry about? Man, that's like right on top of me. I want to know who that girl is that's helping me. Is that a ghost? Oh, that is right there. It seems you are taking a long time. Please proceed as quickly and as quietly as possible. Oh, go eat an ass, dude. Oh, that is right. Oh, hello. Hi, Ballora. Is she dancing in a circle around me? Is that what's going on? Ooh, that is... Right there. Okay, she's far away now. Oh, that's right. That's to my right. Oh, I'm like afraid to breathe or even talk because I don't want to screw up hearing where she's at. Is this door like seven miles away? Holy crap. Motion trigger, breaker room. You may now interface with the breaker control box. Okay. Using the interface may disrupt nearby electronics. If you feel you are in danger, feel free to disconnect the interface temporarily until it is safe to reconnect. What do I do here? I don't know what I do here. Press space to play mascot response. Calm down and go back to sleep. No one is here. Okay. Crap. Where am I? Ballora Gallery, okay. I just really want to... All right. Oh, man. That quickly, huh? Oh. All right, let's do this again. Ooh. That was like her stepping over me.
man. <clears throat> what the hell? Oh, another one of these games? Let's see. Move. Jump. Shift's not letting me jump. Or what? Oh, shift. I was using space because I'm an idiot. Cupcakes, be happy. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Oh crap. Oh no, I don't have enough cupcakes. Now I do. What is going on? Oh. Alright, there we go. Bunch of happy kids now. I. Those jumps seem really hard for some reason. Man, I am totally out of cupcake skin. Oops. What is going on here? Oh, I'm out of cupcakes. I got 20 seconds and three unhappy kids. I gotta hurry. I know I've screwed this up somehow. I figured I might as well give that a shot and see what happens. Okay. Good, we're Motion back here now. Breaker room. You may now interface with the breaker control box. Using the interface may disrupt nearby electronics. If you feel you are in danger, feel free to disconnect the interface temporarily until it is safe to reconnect. Okay, where the hell am I? Which room am I in? Circus Gallery. I don't know how I'm doing this or if I'm doing this right. This is really freaking me out. Yeah, let's keep going back to your stage, please. Okay. Let's go back to our stage. Yes, please. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I hear movement. Come on. You must be hearing things, silly. <laughs> Ooh. I'm guessing I keep playing this until Freddy goes back to his little stage area. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, man. You are, like, right there, aren't you? Go back to your stage, Freddy. It's bedtime. Let's go back to our stage. Go back to your stage, Freddy. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Great job. This completes your tasks oh, for the night. God. Please proceed back through the Ballora Gallery with care, and oh. we'll see you back here tomorrow. Oh, that's crap. I have to do that again. I'm not gonna run as much as I want to. I feel it, I have a feeling if I run, it's totally gonna bone me. Oh, yeah, this has got a lot more going on in it the other than the other Five Nights at Freddy's. Is someone there? No. I can hear someone creeping through my room. Uh. Nobody here but us, uh, dust mites. She's gonna jump out and get me before I get to that vent, isn't she? Ooh. Perhaps not. Thank goodness. I'm not gonna let that put me in a false sense of confidence, though. 
I'm that close. This is super tense. Holy crap. Oh, oh. Oh, thank goodness. Whoa. That is such a relief. Oh. As the sun sets, so also does another chapter in the saga of love lost oh, I love between this. Vlad and his distressed mistress. Look, you're Can so they be sick reconciled? on popcorn again. Can their love rise again? That and more happening now. Clara, the baby isn't mine. It is Vlad. They had trouble catching him in the nursery today. So what? Okay. Lots of kids get hyper and run around and stuff. That's right. They had to knock him out of the air with a broom. I have to go. What good kid doesn't have that job? They're going to dock your paychecks. They can't do that. I'm a vampire. I don't get paychecks. You work the graveyard shift at the Fry Me Taco. Don't lie to me. <laughs> oh, the humanity. When oh, will the heartbreak end? Fantastic. When will these two ships passing in the night rekindle their long lost love? Tune in tomorrow to find out. Oh, I would have never thought of seeing Dracula in a fast food restaurant. <sighs> Daddy just once let me go play with her. She's so pretty and shiny. Didn't you make her just for me? I wonder if that's the ghost that we keep Welcome hearing talking to, to us. Welcome back to another pivotal night of your thriving new career, where you get to really ask yourself, what am I doing with my life? What would my friends say? And most importantly, will I ever see my family again? We understand the stresses of a new job, and we're here for you. To help Those you reach a more stable questions. and relaxing frame of mind, we offer several musical selections to help make this elevator ride as relaxing and therapeutic as possible. We offer contemporary jazz, classical, rainforest ambiance, as well as a wide selection of other choices. Using the keypad below, please type the first few letters of the musical selection you would prefer. <laughs> Does it matter? It seems you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and Screw I will auto-correct it for you. Thank you for selecting Casual Bongos. Okay. Well, now that your elevator experience has been customized to your needs, and you're thoroughly relaxed, it's worth yeah. mentioning that due to your lackluster performance yesterday, your pay has been decreased by a substantial amount. Please I survived. enjoy the rest of your How is that a lackluster performance all right you guys i think this is a good spot to stop the video since i've been berated by the computer voice on numerous nights and had to deal with some of the most awful animatronics i've seen yet so thank you for joining me everyone and i can't wait to see you in the next part of five nights at freddy's sister location see you later everyone Tune in next time. There we go. Did I eat myself sick on popcorn? Am I passing out now? Because that was my intention. <laughs> Daddy, you let the other children go see her. Why won't you let me go? Daddy doesn't like the other children? Welcome back for another night of intellectual stimulation, pivotal career choices, and self-reflection on past mistakes. Uh, I think that We're last one's probably correct. committed to creating correct. a unique and fulfilling work experience. One part of that commitment is ensuring that you don't get tired of the voice that you're hearing right now. Using the keypad below, oh, man. please select a new companion voice. For male, press 1. For female, press 2. For text only, press 3. For other options, press 4. Uh, what's other options? Oh, alright, my keys don't actually work, so I'm gonna have to use this horrifying mess. It seems that you had some trouble with the keypad. I see what you were trying to type, and I will okay. auto-correct it for you. Oh, Thank you I'm... for choosing Angsty Teen. Oh, good. Oh, good. This is gonna be fantastic. Let's get the hell out of here. It sounds like crawling noises through an air duct. Uh, 
That's what that sounds like to me. All right, angsty teen voice, lead me on to man. It's still got the police tape on there, doesn't it? That's not the elevator stopped. You know the routine. You can get out now or whatever. Whatever. Stay here if you want. <laughs> All right, maybe I do like angsty teen voice. Aim for me. I gotta feel like that my head's gonna get cracked open like an egg at some point in this game, right? So we're no longer security guard. It sounds like we're a maintenance or janitor guy. Okay. A hell of an elevator with a big giant weird fan in the center there. You can now open the elevator using that bright red and obvious button. Okay. Let's get to work. There we go. Oh, nothing looks bad about big yellow tape across that door. Allow this isn't a crime scene or anything, is it? Silence with some light-hearted banter. Due to the massive success and even more so the unfortunate closing of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, it was clear that the stage was set, no pun intended, for another contender in children's entertainment. Okay. Unlike most entertainment venues, our robotic entertainers are rented out for private parties during the day. And it's your job to get the robots back in proper working order before the following morning. You are now in the primary control module. It's actually oh, a this looks creepy. space between the two front showrooms. Now, let's get here? started with your daily tasks. View the window to your left. This is the Ballora Gallery party room and dance studio, okay. encouraging kids to get fit and enjoy pizza. Let's sure. turn on the light and see if Bellora is on stage. Uh, Press the blue button on the elevated keypad to your left. From the looks of this room, I don't really want to push anything or see outside. Can I, can I mess with that clock there? No. What is going on with these severed heads that are blinking at me? Okay. That's not weird. We're creepy. Alright. That's enough screwing around. Uh, uh oh. It looks like Ballora doesn't feel like dancing. Okay. Let's give her some motivation. Press the red button now to administer a controlled shock. Maybe oh. that will put the spring back in her step. Uh. Let's I... check the light again. Oh, I don't know. Pissing off the animatronics Excellent. with an electrical chill. Probably not the best like idea. Again, and we'll be ready to perform again tomorrow. Now view the window to your right. This is the Funtime Auditorium, where Funtime Foxy encourages kids to oh, play good. and Who are you? <laughs> Try the light. Let's see what Funtime Foxy is up to. Yeah, Foxy's not there. Looks like Funtime Foxy is taking the day off. Let's motivate Funtime Foxy with a controlled shock. Huh. Let's piss off Foxy with a shock, how about that, right? Foxy's never been a pain in the ass before. Nothing? Let's try another controlled shock. Okay, yeah, let's really piss Foxy off. Ooh. Looks like Funtime Foxy is in perfect working order. Great job! In front of you is another vent shaft. Crawl through it to reach the Circus Gallery control module. Click these. Okay, there feels like there's kind of a lot of stuff you can do, like... <laughs> I don't know why you'd ever want to do that. That is creepy, but you can totally click on that. Okay, so I can crawl or go faster with the shift button. I'm definitely going to go faster because well, I don't like the Mission idea of... Trigger. Circus gallery vent. What does that mean? Hmm. On the other side of the glass is Circus Baby's auditorium. Let's check the light and see what Baby is up to. Oh, I'm assuming that's Circus Baby in the... Poster there. What is going on with these little dudes hanging out here? Looks like a few of the lights are out, but we can fix that later. Okay. Let's encourage Baby to cheer up with a control shock. <laughs> Let's piss this one off too, huh? All right. Uh, Let's try another controlled shock. Okay. Uh, it's not working. Let's try another controlled shock. 
Uh, are you sure about this, Mr. Handy? Oh, man. Great job, Circus Baby. We knew we could count on you. Uh, that concludes your duties for your first night on the job. We don't want you to leave overwhelmed. Otherwise, she's you not might on the not stage. Please leave using the vent behind you, and we'll see you again tomorrow. How do I do that? Because I really would like to get out of here. Oh, S to go back. Okay. What was that? Um, I'm going. Circus Gallery. That's a... Alright, shift completed. Day one, right? Oh, I love how this game is just lulling you into a sense of self-confidence. Another false day, self -confidence. another dramatic entry in the lives of Vlad and his distressed mistress. Where will they go? What will they do? Oh, I can eat popcorn. All of that and more happening now. Okay. Clara, I tell you, the baby isn't mine. Count, I tell you that it is. You're the only vampire I've ever loved. And the baby turns his bottles into powdered milk. I'm um, way into that popcorn. That doesn't mean anything. He sleeps on the ceiling fan. What, everyone does that. Or upside down. What does it matter? You need to be part of your son's life. I'm an old man, Clara. I can't be a father. Well, then at least pay your child support, you <laughs> deadbeat! <laughs> Will Vlad and his distress... Oh, I totally watch a vampire soap wrong? opera. There's no doubting what you've achieved on a technical level. These are clearly state-of-the-art. There are just certain design choices that were made for these robots that we don't fully understand. We were hoping that you could shed some light on those. She can dance. She can sing. She's equipped with a built-in helium tank for inflating balloons right at her fingertips. She can take song requests. She can even dispense ice cream. With all due respect, those aren't the design choices we were curious about, Mr. Afton. Hey everyone, it's Oscar. Welcome to the newly released Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. Now, I've been pretty eager to try this game, so let's not waste any time and let's see what it has in store for us. Daddy, why won't you let me play with her? Huh. Not sure what that was referring to. Welcome to the first day of your exciting new career. Whether you were approached at a job fair, read our ad in screws, bolts, and hairpins, or if this is the result of a dare, we will. This is totally you. a dare. I will be your personal guide I'd to help like you to get started. Leave. I'm a Model 5 of the Handyman's Robotics and Unit Repair System, but you can call me Hand Unit. Your new career promises challenge, intrigue, and endless janitorial opportunities. Oh, good. Please enter your name and stream of the keypad. Cleaning this toilets. cannot be changed later, so please be careful. Okay, let's see if I can actually do this. Uh, uh, let's... It seems that you had some oh. trouble with the keypad. Yeah, kind of. see what you were trying to type, and I will auto-correct it for you. One moment. Welcome, Eggs Benedict. I'll take it. I like Eggs Benedict. I'll take it. It's a fine name.